Here we go then, semi-final number two, the line-up, Leon Madsen off the inside in red, Freddie Lindgren out of gate number two in blue, Ty Woofen and out of gate three in white, and Robert Lambert from the outside in yellow. Earlier on, Robert Lambert made a fabulous start and actually got across the opposition yeah. to actually clamp them down on the inside. If he can do that, then he'll be set for the final for sure. Certainly a lot of interest in this race once again. Crucial championship points on the line. Lingren looking for the opportunity to try and battle his way back in potentially into third place in the world championship. Uh, maybe, uh, yeah, it depends on what Doyle does. That's going to get very tight indeed. Doyle already through, of course, after a hard-fought second place in semi-final number one. Really did have to hang on because Holder was coming on strong. Woofenden, now, can he produce some magic out of gate number three? Hasn't been a great night for him, but he finds himself here with another opportunity for his first final of the year. Here we go, then. Semi-final number two. Tapes up now. We're underway. Good start on the inside from Madsen, but a better one from Lingwin. What a run to the first corner. Here comes Woofenden. Woofenden has come through there, but Leon Madsen. Lambert uh, is coming through as well, but Leon Madsen, they went either side of Woofenden down the back straight, but Freddie Lingwin, there's just no holding him back. Disappointing in his last qualifying ride, but he fires himself to the front in semi-final number two. Uh, Lingwin has been pretty consistent this year, and uh, as you say, disappointing last time out. He's making no mistake here. He's pulling clear of Madsen, who in turn is pulling clear of uh, Robert Lambert. He's had to battle with Ty Woffenden, trying to defend. He needs every championship point he can get. But this race settling down up front with Freddie Lindgren and Leon Madsen set to go through. Freddie Lindgren out in front. Disappointment for the Brits. They're going to miss out on the final this evening. But for Leon Madsen making another final, he's looking good in second place. But for fast Freddie Lindgren after the disappointment in Tetro two weeks ago where he failed to make the semi-finals, he's in another final. Super ride from fast Freddie. Got a great run into the first corner out of gate number two. Just got the better of Madsen, but Madsen was composed enough to hang on to second place with Robert Lambert certainly strutting his stuff early doors but uh, the two Scandinavians are through and they will join Smarslik and Jason Doyle in the final Lingren through to the final once again Leon Madsen there in second place he's through as well Robert Lambert and Ty Wolfenden missing out in semi-final number two disappointment for them in the end particularly for Lambert Lambert looked really good tonight and he'll be a touch frustrated by the fact that he didn't make the final here tonight. He will be, yeah, but uh, Freddie Lindgren makes no mistake there. Just lifts before he gets to the corner. That run, that means he cannot get across to the inside. He's a door open for Woofenden. At this point, it looks like Woofenden has perhaps stolen the march into second place, but they swallow him up before he gets down into turn three. And uh, Madsen then just settles down around the inside, makes the bike work nicely, continues his uplifting form finished second on the podium in Prague and then made the semi-finals in Tetro. So uh, his improvement continues. Yeah, he's going the right way. He came in uh, to the championship uh, round here in Gorzhov on 42 points. Going, um, uh, um, in sixth place, so uh, he's going to improve on that, that's for sure. But for Freddie Lingren, clearly delight there to have made uh, another final.